Justin Bieber's pastor disses Post Malone for comments he made about JB and their church. Plus, Selena Gomez and The Weeknd apparently have a new feud. Hey guys, it's Gino with your Daily Bieber, and Forbes just revealed 23-year-old Justin Bieber is one of the highest earning musicians of 2017, raking in more than $83 million. Justin collected the highest annual earnings of his career so far from his Purpose Tour shows, music streaming, and Calvin Klein endorsement deal. He also made a killing from his Just Mojis, which on a personal note, I bought for my iPhone, and they have totally stopped working and disappeared. So thanks Justin, you owe me a refund. While JB did have an amazing year stealing my money, he was ranked at number 7 on the Forbes list, while his arch nemesis The Weeknd was ranked at number 4, earning $92 million. Another win for Justin, Spotify just revealed Justin's Despacito remix was the second most streamed song of 2017, with I'm the One landing at number 5. Anyway, to Post Malone's feud with Justin and his Hillsong Church. Post revealed he felt JB was turning super religious and that his Hillsong Church is quote, real culty. He also claimed that Justin donated over $10 million to the church and added, those are the worst kinds of people. I used to be super religious. I believed in God, but now I see through it. It's nice to support something you believe in, I guess, but people are spending so much money and God doesn't care that your church has a fucking gold roof. Well now, part-time Supreme model and JB's pastor buddy Carl Lentz fired back at Post telling Rolling Stone, I have no idea why Post would say such reckless things about our church, which he has never visited. Justin has not given our church 10 million and we do not have gold ceilings. We do not even own a church church building so that gives you a little insight about how serious you can take his observations about anything to do with us. Carl Lentz just took Post Malone to church, however, Carl, I don't think Post was literally saying your church has a golden roof. He's making a point, and I'd also like to point out, Carl has not said Justin didn't give a ton of money to the church, just that the sum wasn't 10 million. I have a really hard time believing that Justin's close friend Post Malone would just make this whole thing up. Speaking of church, Justin attended a service in LA and was also seen play fighting with his buddy Harry Hudson before threatening to fight the paps. Jokingly, of course, although we all know that shit can get real if you push him. Selena Gomez was also at the same service, however, she wasn't spotted with Justin and was seen covering her face as she left. To Selena and The Weeknd's feud, Life & Style is now claiming Abelina are fighting over their dog, Charlie. The Meg reports after Selena and The Weeknd split, Cell took the dog because she considered it a gift rather than a mutual adoption and she's determined to keep it. However, the gossip that Meg also claims Abel never saw it that way and he thinks he should have custody of Charlie because Selena won't be able to take care of it properly with her busy schedule. This story does seem suspect, but then again, recall, Sal did mention to Billboard that adopting Charlie was Abel's doing. Selena also briefly put her IG account on private and had a bit of an insta tantrum over quotes she supposedly made to Billboard about a stuffed teddy bear being misrepresented. So maybe she's capable of being upset about the dog situation too? But alright, to all my fluffy teddy bears and dogs on YouTube. I need you to click right up here to subscribe to our channel so we can keep you updated on all the latest Jelena news.